What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. What's up? This is Ricardo. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a little rundown on my Hackintosh and how I built it. So originally it was my gaming PC and I needed a video editing computer and my MacBook Pro was not strong enough. It was a 13 inch 2015 model. So instead I had two options. I had either make a Hackintosh or buy a very expensive iMac. And since I already had a gaming PC that I don't do much gaming anymore with, um, I thought I'd shoot that. After all my research on the forums, I saw that Gigabyte was the most common motherboard to be hack and touchable, and I couldn't find anything on my parts for MSI. Um, so I took a gamble and I followed Morganaut's vanilla install. Uh, I wiped one of my extra SSDs that I had lying around, and sure enough, it booted changed the bio settings to what I thought was best and I'll link it down below in the description um, and it took a while but it was able to get up and running I had no issues with iMessage App Store um, so here we can see iMessage really quick and then we can do the App Store Perfect. And then I've done some Geekbench, it works. The only thing that I have an issue with on this computer is if I go to Finder, it doesn't show my hard drive. But the fix for that is go to computer and it shows it here. So I can always change it and go from there. But that's the only workaround. This Mac, it treats it like if it's a iMac Retina 5K. Um, it's registering the Intel i4 i5, I'm at 24 gigs of DDR3. Uh, I had a GTX 970 in here, but it wasn't registered in Mojave, so I purchased this on Amazon for about 160 and that's about it. It's displaying everything correctly, shows this, shows the RAM, and all that jazz. So we're, we're pretty solid. Final Cut Pro, super easy scrubbing, I'm actually editing this video on here. I'm gonna need the volume of the music, but it's able to scrub. I do have it set to 1080, but 4K works just as fine. Um, everything's been really great on this from upgrading from my MacBook Pro, so that's what I thoroughly enjoy. Um, I have everything working, iMaps, all that jazz. It turns on and off easily. And this is just me showing my 2015 <laughs> iMac that I have now that was a gaming computer. So I'm very, very happy with it. If you guys have any questions on the steps by steps that I had to go through and you have the same systems, comment below and I'll be sure to reply. But everything, I've had zero issues with this so far. And if I want to go back to my desktop, all I have to do is switch out the SSDs and then it'll still boot up into the windows even with the bio settings i have for mac os 